music that plays like when you're in the Temple of Lightning and Earth. Yeah, like full, full force. Do 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 do. Yeah, that one's, that, one's, that one's a classic one from from the first game. Mhm. Mm and you better watch out for. Never mind. I. Don't worry. I don't worry. I know. I know how to get the advantage in battles. It's just that sometimes enemies can no, can notice me before I have a chance, so so then, so then I don't get my I don't so then I miss my opportunity to get the to get the advantage. And a fire phoenix. Get rid of that one. I have to say, the, I have to say, the other world gate looks really, looks really nice. Yeah, considering it's all like I'm having seizures of thing all pink and pink and purple. Mhm. Mm and the background looks really nice as well. Yeah. Soon, I'm about to learn uh, the art Sword Rain Alpha, which is, which is actually a really nice art. I actually really love that art. And I'm much more of a Light Spirit Cannon. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I used lights, I used a bunch of Light Spirit Cannons during during that battle with um, Dex Malice. And then my dog was barking. I don't know if you can hear that. I can hear him. Mm. <laughs> Do you, do you try to be as overpowered as possible? Yes. Yeah. Me too. Yeah, but the but the first time I played this game, I I, I wasn't that overpowered. Oh uh, yeah, it's yeah. Once um yeah, if you um it's yeah the first time playing through the game, it's it's it it can be really difficult. Like if you if you because uh, if you're not knowing if you're not knowing like your boss strategies and such. And there we go, I learned Sword Rain Alpha. Sword Rain Alpha! Alright, and then now, we move on to this area. Mm -mm. And as you can see from a distance, you can see the Heroes of Regeneration, and look at that, they are stone. Mm -hmm. And we have... The Mind some... Slicer. And, then and we have some item chest. Item... We have some items yep. in these treasure boxes. And so we got the Red Verb... Verbena and Angel Dust. Mhm. Mm you can actually use those to synthesize your weapons. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't, I didn't take advantage. I didn't take advantage of uh, of any of that. Let's see. Even though, even though it would help, but I, I, I just, I just didn't do it. All right. So I'm just gonna avoid these enemies because because I already fought them and there's no point in me showing them again. But then but then I just but then I had to but then I had to fight that enemy because because he was in my way and I couldn't escape him. You could just loop around him. Nah, I, I could. But 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 eh, I didn't know what I was thinking. And wow, that's not fair. I got myself I got myself gained up right there. Yeah, but those three monster knights. Yeah. And I was thinking of using um, a life a, a life bottle right there, but because Marta was using resurrection, um, I didn't, I, um, I just decided to let her, but obviously she's too slow. Mm. Alright, making our way to saving our friends. And you better watch out for that. Never mind. <laughs> I fight every enemy I see because because I like experience. I like I like to be overpowered. Well, actually, well, I'm well. I'm at well. I, at this point, I'm not really that overpowered. I'm just at a bit of a decent level since I usually I usually train before I take on all. Like if I know, like if I'm gonna take on a boss that's that I'm gonna have a hard time with, I usually train for for that. Mm. Mm. All right, and here we are. Oh, excuse me. Just... And here's another item, a red, red basil. basil. Yep. Is that an actual thing, a red basil? I believe it's a her uh, an herb of some kind. Um, and it's Lloyd! Emil! Marta! Lloyd! You're alright! Unfortunately, I'm the only one who wasn't affected. 
Have the others been turned to stone? How do you know? Because I'm sorry. He knows. It seems that I. And we saw I him mean, in the distance. Raditas set a trap for the owners of the Daris emblem. I see. That's why the Daris emblem glowed. But why were you spared? Maybe because I have Martell's protection. Come on, we need to save everyone. Emil, you can save them, right? Yeah. Okay, then let's hurry. There's something I want to ask you. You've accepted the fact that you're Ratatosk, and made up your mind to do your duty and protect the door, correct? Yes. You're not thinking of letting Richter defeat you and turn yourself into a core so you can become a lock on the door. If you feel guilty about Aster and planning on doing that... No! I won't let Richter kill me! Come on, guys! We don't have time for all this chit-chat! Sorry, we're coming! I trust you, Emil. Don't let me down. And there's Lloyd. Mm -hmm. And there's the safe point. Uh-huh. That was a mistake. We should have left the Daris emblems behind. Were the Daris emblems something you needed during the journey of regeneration? Yeah, we couldn't have done it without them. Which is why I never expected them to work against us. I guess you could never tell. But Martell's protection is really powerful. No, I think it's only that way against Ratatosk. They're both tree spirits, so maybe they cancel each other out or something. You're probably right. Huh. Lloyd, you really know your stuff. I agree. I must admit I had my doubts after hearing so many people describe you as a fool and a bumbling idiot. But it would appear I was quite mistaken. And who exactly were these people? Those people who thought that you were actually the one who did who did the stuff, but it turns out to be Dex in the end. <laughs> yup. Look at them. This is terrible! Emil, do something to help them! Right. Um, Tenebrae? The curse should dissolve as soon as you touch them. Alright. I'll give it a try. Man, I can finally move! You were conscious? Yes. It was as if I was in a straitjacket and couldn't move at all. I could see everyone around me was petrified, so I just assumed I was too. That was horrible. My whole body was tingling. It felt like I was frozen in place. I'm sorry. It's my fault. You could not have foreseen these circumstances. Don't worry about it. Well, it looks like everyone's more or less back to normal. Alright, now let's make up for lost time and kick some butt! Yeah, Emil needs all our help! You can count on us! a pact with the demons right now. I won't let you disturb him. Centurion Aqua, are you aware of what you're doing? Yes, of course. Right now, I'm doing everything I can to make sure Lord Ratatosk never comes back again. Why did you decide to side with Richter and betray us? Because I want to help Master Richter avenge his friend. Master Richter and Aster first learned about Lord Ratatosk through their research of summon spirits. They found me and told me they wanted to advise Lord Ratatosk about the Centurions losing control. I brought them to the Ginoon Gagap, to the door to the demonic realm, just beyond here. But Lord Ratatosk simply refused to listen to what Master Richter and Aster had to say. I couldn't believe it. 
Instead, he lashed out at them because of his hatred of mankind. He killed Aster, and Master Richter was gravely wounded. After surviving the ordeal, Master Richter searched for the power to bring Aster back to life. That's it. So that's why he's forming a pact with demons. Yes, in return for resurrecting his friend, Master Richter will open the door leading to Nibelheim. Whoa, wait a minute. Are you serious? Can't you see? You are the ones who are wrong! Lord Ratatosk ordered us to annihilate mankind! How can you possibly help him? He even took the form of Aster when appearing before Master Richter! He, the one responsible for his death! No one is going to make Master Richter suffer anymore! If I can help Master Richter avenge his friend, if I can help him grant his wish, then one thing's certain, I won't hesitate to kill Lord Ratatosk himself! Okay, and now fight a monster controlled by Aqua. This battle is very easy. Uh huh, because it's four against one, and you're all set. And he does not, and this, and this does not attack a lot. And, and, when, and, when, and when it does land an attack, it does quite a lot of damage. It's but it's not too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too bad for battle. Alright. So hit him as much as you can, and you should be able to win. Oh. Also, Lloyd's special attack isn't really that amazing. Yeah, here we go. Just have to, Divine just have, Justice! Just have to show I just have to show it off at one point, so I actually really like this last but, but um Yeah, it's not it's not it's not that amazing. I should I should um I think do you think I should uh, show off every character's special attack? Yeah. Uh select special, uh rain special like everyone else is special. Yeah. I've so far, so far I've shown the special attack for Kiel, uh, Lloyd, Alice, Dex, Commander Brute, and Red. Yeah. yeah, there's not much. There's not much uh, uh, for me uh, to say about this battle. It's just considering it's it's very, very, very easy. Yep, and now here comes another divine justice. And this time I land 19 hits on that one. Huh? Yeah, I decide to use I decide to use uh Lloyd because because once again Lloyd Lloyd is my favorite is my favorite character. What's your who, who's your favorite character? Mm. Uh, mm. It's, it, it's gonna be half the Lloyd. <laughs> Cause I don't, I don't, I never actually played the other characters except for like, uh, the Light, Lloyd, Emil, and Mardo, that's it. Uh, back in Tales of Onion 1, I, I like Lloyd, I also like Kratos, uh, which, which, uh, does not make a return to this game. Um, uh, I also like, um, Zellers, he was awesome. And, uh, as well as Persea, he said Persea's axe is so amazing. You should try out her special, Crimson De Crimson Devastation. Yeah, yeah. Once, once again, I'll, I'll make a video showing off all, all characters' special attacks. And the, you should show off the boss specials too. Yeah, yeah. And, and there we go. I'm glad we won. Mm -hmm. And. Emil, and let's see what Emil learns. Emil learns add combo two, which I'll take advantage of next battle. Why is Aqua in pain? She turned her own body into a monster. Now she herself has also been hurt by the battle. Aqua. Although you are a Centurion, you love Victor. Master Richter! I was only 
able to buy you a little time. Please, forgive me. Marta, will you hold on to her for me? Okay. But aren't you going to make a pact with her? No. It can wait. I think it would be cruel to hatch her, and then form a pact with her right now. Oh, I understand. And then we learn probably the most useless skill because there are no monsters up ahead, or at least there are no water monsters up ahead. Aqua's love. I still find it hard to believe that Centurions are capable of falling in love. I must admit my own surprise. However, just as cores may affect the hearts of people, a strong will may also affect the cores. I think I know what you mean. The human heart seems fragile, but it's actually pretty tough. Yeah. When someone feels anger or sadness, they can affect other people with their emotions. And sometimes there's nothing you can do to help them, even if you want to. But you can also spread positive emotions. And there are plenty of times when people's hearts are touched and they don't even realize it. That is true. Aqua must have been influenced by the strength of Richter's conviction, and it changed her. It may very well be your hearts that hold the key to success in the coming struggle. Alright, and... Hey, Emil. It oh, we already seen this already. Now. Skip it. Skip it. Skip I mean, it. Skip it. Than Skip we it. it. There we go. Mm -hmm. Getting stronger. Yep. I've already shown that already. So, Lord Emil... You've come to ask if I'm really gonna do this? Yes. I'm sorry, Tenebrae. I've made up my mind. I'm gonna take on the role of Ratatosk. I know that's not what you want to hear. I will keep my promise to you. Hmm? I am your Centurion. Whatever you have decided, I will obey you to the end. Thank you. Lord Ratatosk's domain is up ahead. where the Ginoon Gagap is? Yes. Richter should be there. Emil, the time's come for you to regain your power as Ratatosk and close the Ginoon Gagap. That's what you've chosen to do, right? Right. Everyone, it looks like it's almost the over, I bet, but I, I still bet, need your I help. I bet this place is, like, really hot. Up ahead is, uh, Lord Ratatosk. Lord Ratatosk domain. Well, we're finally mm -hmm. here. Marta, Tenebrae, thank you for all you've done. Emil. Don't talk like this is the end. We're not giving up on you yet. Yeah, you're right. Lloyd, everyone, I want to thank you as well. Oh, come on, cut the formalities. It's time. Let's give this everything we've got. We shall be right there beside you. I won't hold back, even if we are fighting a half-elf. We've come this far after all. We must see our task through to the end. Richter may have his reasons, but nothing justifies turning this world into a demonic realm. We worked so hard to regenerate this world. We have to protect it. Right. We can't break our promise to Martel. This is a fight to reclaim your identity too. Give him a show he won't forget. Everyone, let's go. All right. And with that, next episode is going to be the finale. So thank you guys so much for watching. And next time we're going to take on Richter for the final time. <laughs>